love me some CU Boulder. Faster is one of my favorite people in collegiate esports. But holy cow, Fullerton just looks so consistent today, <laughs> Spood. Coming up, showing he's not messing around. Not at all. Fullerton coming out of the gates, swinging, kicking it off, running here. And what a touch from Spood. Neither want to make a mistake, but we have to be with ourselves. It's on CU Boulder to kind of push the button on this issue and create a goal-scoring opportunity. We know with how Fullerton have been, they're welcome to hold on to a one-goal lead. This time, though, they extended some fantastic little mechanics from Spood actually getting just way up on this pass from Fear Classic. Taps it in over the top defender. There's nothing left to block it. Looks a little bit wide. Now they got to rotate back. Not too much boost in the hands of Fullerton as well. This is a great opportunity if we can see CU Boulder capitalize. Flover down, shot, bar down. There There's the is. first. The first, but not the last here for CU Boulder. We're just over halftime relegation for this first round. And now they are just one away from tying up. With, but Fullerton are so, so on point today with both their offense and their defense. Even when Boulder, oh, hey, that time's hard. I should just, I guess, keep talking about that so we get more ties. This is like, even if Boulder gets an opportunity, it's so hard to break through that barrier. But we just saw it happen. Three and three in that first game started with the uh, overtime that they experienced. There was two minutes what? of overtime. No what? way. What just happened? Did his car break? <laughs> his car break. Yeah, something happened right there. He wasn't able Wait, to get the bounce? jump that he was okay. looking for there. Oh. A redirect, an unfortunate redirect by Fear Classic. Uh, award that we will be giving out to a Rocket League player who really stands out here today. So this is the last opportunity now for that player to come through. And in the last second, last 43, Spoots ties it up. Putting their name in the ticket for that. But look at this pass by Fear Classic as well. Actually just sets it up. Benji looking for the goal scoring opportunity while the demolition's there. Good save by Flover. Buffer trying to slow this one down. Just wants a moment to breathe. <laughs> it's not going to be given to him. Benji in with another shot. Spoot goes up. And the goal goes in four to three in game number one. It's CSUF at a two to nothing lead. Two to nothing, not quite match point. Well, a great shot coming out of Fear Classic, but this time it's Thumper that's going to turn that one away. Spood trying to get control over the top of the goal here. And Fear Classic finally, after shot after shot, is able to find uh, it. Yeah, I mean, you hit it shot after shot. That must have been five things at least going on frame here for them. But finally, Fear Classic. Of course it's Fear Classic. Such a consistent finisher. The Flover may be looking for a double touch off the wall here. Goes back to control of Fear Classic up along the wall. And oh. it's a beautiful, that was a, that was a teamwork pinch play right there, Nor. I gotta, I gotta watch the replay, hold up. Up. Yeah, be quiet, He's Fear watching. Classic, Benji, oh my Look at that. goodness. Look at that. Especially another player, let alone the ground or a wall, right? Because there can be any sort of slight Angular navigation that just upsets the direction of that, but that's going to roll in. No way. Benji just throwing nails in the coffin now. And it looked like it went past the defender. I'm not sure if it's a bump or we'll see right about here. Thumper gets Ooh. it. Benji just dunks it in on him, though. Tin reversed. I, I don't remember if it was a reverse sweep, Yokes? but it was definitely a huge play. There we go. Yokes is going to find one. First one of this round after just a minute 15. That was a promising minute 15, though. They kept it in the Fullerton half pretty much the entire time. It was pressure. It was shots. That was exactly what you like to see. To, to pull the big red lever on the wall labeled emergency and just change <laughs> the plan. And they're going for exactly that, playing much more aggressively, trying to play goal for goal. We'll see if Fullerton decides to match or continues oh. to try to defend. They'll match, yep. playing aggressively in the attacking half. Fear Classic with a beautiful finish. And again, it, it's an easy finish, but he's putting himself in position to make these finishes time after time after time. Like Detroit. And see if Fear Classic can bring this one down. No, Yokes actually challenges early. This could be dangerous. Fake! Mm, still doesn't go through. Not enough momentum on the ball. Oh. In the meantime, that tie is going to be broken with 2.24 left on the clock. Fear Classic with with a solo carryover. I mean, it's just a goal scoring machine at this point. We He's have been seen a goal scoring machine all day. We have seen the U Bowler have a way in, but only a minute 40 on. Fear Classic gets booted in for the oh! shot. And it's all three members combining, doing a little fusion dance on the side of Fullerton to finally make this shot work. I love the flips there from Fear Classic and Benji. Both of them communicating so well to say, all right, I got this. Boot actually going to play this one out. I like that Fear Classic puts this off the wall. If they play this fast, they can get there. Thumper, that was a huge touch for them. If that ball went up the wall, it might have been lights out. Spoon instead going to knock it back in the corner where Benji can challenge, tries to predict the wall ball. Instead, it'll be redirected out towards Fear Classic. Goes up for a 50-50. Shots over. Spoon to receive. 
One more goal could be the nail in the coffin here. Jolly and Benji wants it. It's a perfect oh. placement on the shot. And Fullerton will not stop until they lift the trophy. All right. These really are feeling like nails in the coffin now. Yokes gets a demo. Able to follow it up with a shot. Not very close to the goal line, though. Thumper with the follow-up, but Spood gets there just too fast, and that's how it's feeling. Feels like uh, the boost is kind of favoring uh, CSU Fullerton right now as Spood locks in another. I walks in is the right word, man. Flover tries to defend the backboard. They get in there. 39 seconds left. Though so bouncing off that crossbar, now maybe a chance for Boulder to find a shot on goal themselves. They did manage one. Spood with some beautiful redirection, though, and my God, can, they have families. Do these we people, end the grand finals on a Brazil? These people have families. Okay, you can't do them like that, right? Like, is this cyberbullying? Is, does this qualify know. as cyberbullying yet? Fullerton certainly playing some Did fantastic Rocket League. I mean, see you, Boulder, I think, at this point. A little checked out. I, it was 5-1. to one, But they played a good series. The, the adaptation was there. And every time we saw them play, they got better. But I think we just saw the same thing out of Fullerton, right? Every single game was an improvement. Uh, a Brazil you from it? Fear you Classic. It's it, the grand final. The, the actual Brazil happened in the grand final. <laughs> yeah, and it was ju it was just as painful as then as it is right now here, because t 11 seconds, not a lot of time. It's definitely looking like a Brazil scoreline. At least Boulder has that one goal, so they can feel good about themselves in that sense. But today, it has been CSU Fullerton's day. Hey, no, no Brazil. Brazil. Let's break that. Yeah, get that out of here. Great I job, Flover. It is wild because they, they did attempt to save this. Fear Classic just unfortunately misses a little bit on the challenge there. And 